I will give the floor to Americans for Democracy and Human Rights in Bahrain. Mr. Vice President, we would like to call the Council's attention to Bahrain's violation of the Vienna Declaration and Program, program of Action regarding the freedom of religion. Indeed, the VDPA highlights the state's obligation to provide for the right to freedom of thought, conscience, expression and religion. According to the VDPA, all individuals should be, able, should be able to profess and practice their religion. Overwhere, the government of Bahrain discriminates against the Shia citizens. Indeed, the authority of Bahrain prevents the majority of its population from freely practicing their religion. They destroyed mosque, place of worship, imprisoned Shia clerics, and prevented the celebration of religious ceremonies. The repression of the Ashura during the Muharram is emblematic of the systematic repression of Shia religious expression. During the Ashura religious, religious commemoration, the Minister of Interior, under the direct order of the current Minister Sheikh Rashid bin Abdul Al Khalifa, summoned and detained several Shia religious scholars and Shia citizens because they have practiced their faith. Moreover, during the month of July and August, the government used the current pandemic to impose further restrictions on Ashura Shia celebration. For example, they decided to ban the broadcasting of Quran recitation, sermons and speeches through speakers solely for Matams and Uzainias, which are used by the Shia citizens. Therefore, using the pandemic as an opportunity to double down the restriction of religious and cultural expression within the Shia community. I thank you. Merci.